My lord, drop my things in the crew bunks. Good ship. Quinn's already briefed me. I'm handling demolitions and heavy firepower support. Didn't know the captain ran things round here. I'd rather take my orders direct. Quinn handles the details, but you answer to me. Fine with me. Just keep Captain Protocol off my back. Moff Hurden was all about regulations too. War Trust did a lot more damage than they should have. Hurden didn't think a soldier could strategize. Proved him wrong. Hurden was a fool to ignore your natural talents. Doesn't matter much now. I'm here, and Hurden stuck on Taris. Give me the freedom he didn't, and you'll see results. I hope you have the talent to back up your talk. Just say the word. I'll show you what I can do. Apprentice, the Ward Trust dismantling has been your finest hour, but a new challenge arises. One of our missing targets, Admiral Monk, has revealed himself. As you may recall, my master Darth Vengeance set off to conquer the fringe systems and inspire the Dark Council to reignite the war. Somehow, Admiral Monk caught wind of the plan and was waiting in ambush. He is laying siege to the flagship as we speak. I'll stop the siege, Master. That is an excellent idea. Plan Zero calls for Admiral Monk's head. This may be our only opportunity to crush him. Our flagship is commanded by Moff Maskin. Fly to the space battle immediately. Board his ship and stop Admiral Monk's siege.
Moff Maskern, I presume. Darth Barris sent me. I've liberated your ship. Where is Admiral Monk? Well, well. Come to inspect the scene of the crime, eh? Admiral Monk and his top men jettison down to Quesh. I'm so sorry you missed him. Are you here to deliver his reward? Offer congratulations? What are you talking about? This was a secret attack, yet I come out of hyperdrive to find the Republic's most decorated Admiral laying in wait. Admiral Monk had my force field and docking codes. This stinks of a setup. I suggest you clean house and find the rat. This was no Imperial leak! Your master's master is Darth Venger. Barras manipulated him into this attack in order to ruin him. I've had a bellyful of Sith infighting, always undermining Imperial operations. It's why we have yet to crush the Republic outright! Let me end your suffering, Maskin. Swarms, men! The Sith attacks! <laughs> Master, remember the last Imperial port we were docked at? Because I don't. I think I partied a little too hard there. I vaguely recall an Imperial soldier. I think he and I, uh, got to know each other. Either that or I might have killed him. Or both, maybe. It's fuzzy. I see you're enjoying yourself. The way I see it, I work hard, so I should play hard. But don't get me wrong, I'm not really interested in nameless, faceless, possibly lifeless grunts. I'm sure true sustenance will come from more substantive experiences. I suggest you focus on finding some, then. Your advice goes a long way with me, Master. My next furlough will be spent doing exactly that. I'll be ready for your next order. My lord, I am receiving reports of a failed military incursion. It seems one of our special ops battalions was following shaky intel and walked into an ambush. We're the only ship in the sector that can relay their distress calls to high command. Permission to transmit their coordinates for extraction. Do it. Immediately. Yes, my lord. Hopefully the consequences of this blunder can be lessened. What's on your mind? Nothing. Why, you expect me to be all mopey? It's too nice outside. Let's play two truths and a lie. I tell you three things about me, and you tell me which isn't true. I'll play along. Go ahead. Okay, here goes. I've been in jail 16 times. I've got three sisters. I've worked as a hired assassin. Which one is a lie? There is no way you would take money to kill someone. Turns out, it depends on how much money, and how much the person needs to die. Okay, enough games. I wouldn't want someone to start thinking the Sith were getting fun. Here for inoculation. You'll need form 1423 slash D. 
And, uh, oh, excuse me. Sorry, my lord, I thought you were another recruit. No paperwork required. I take it you're here to fight in the Quesh War? What war? Sorry, thought you'd been briefed. I can't talk about military operations. Let's just say it's a hazardous fight. Quesh is highly toxic, poisoned by the resource the Republic's mining. You'll need a protective injection just to survive. There we go. That treatment will protect you for the time being. The protection wears off. The effects will fade eventually, but you can receive more treatments planetside. You're cleared. Talk to Moff Drayson if you want to fight. He's in charge of the Empire's war effort. thirsty to take Quesh. What say we quench that thirst? The Empire can't afford another loss, Major. We must crush the Republic immediately. They've been on quest for years. We can't destroy their entire mining operation overnight. Gentlemen, we have company. I am Moff Drayson, head of Quesh Imperial Forces. You're here to join our war against the Republic? Bring me up to speed. Quesh is a valuable planet, if you can believe it. We're here to stop the Republic's operation. Don't waste your energy on her. A woman has no place on the battlefield. There's more power in my fist than in your entire army. <gasps> Enough. Save it for the Republic. They're responsible for our assignment to this toxic rock. The Republic went digging and found the source of this planet's poison. The miners call it Quesh Venom. Lies just below the planet's surface. We distill the stuff into Quell, a lethal poison. But the Republic knows how to refine it into high-grade adrenals. They've been processing the toxins into adrenals for years, with hot help, no less. We've come to conquer their operation and claim Quesh's venom for the Empire. Tear down the Republic. Grind them into Quesh's soil. I knew you'd have the appetite for this work. The Republic's defeat must be devastating. Push them enough on Quesh, and the Republic will be provoked into open warfare across the galaxy. Once they violate the Treaty of Coruscant, the Empire can strike without risking neutral worlds joining in. We must rile their temper. I have a talent for rousing the Republic's fury. I can't wait to see you test their restraint. First, we strike the Republic's venom mines. The venom produces noxious gas. That's why Quesh is so lovely. It's most lethal in the mines. So the Republic installed specialized filters. Destroy those filters. Release the poisonous gas, and the Republic will have to flee the mines. They'll declare the mines a disaster site when I'm finished. Take out every weapon emplacement you can, 
Then get inside and destroy the filtration units. Don't stop until the mines are choked with poison.
Let us out. We're trapped and... Wait. You're with the Empire. Did the dead commanders give me away? We have nothing against you. Open the door. We don't care about the Republic. We just want out. When you breathe your last gasp of Quesh venom fumes, remember the Republic put you here. Fine. Leave us. I won't waste my last words begging.
You good? My lord, Sergeant Molvar. Had a cousin who was Sith. Very powerful. Died young. Wish he was here now. Operation was to move in, secure the area for a supply depot, move troops and equipment deeper into the mines. Casualties, 13. Dead, 12. And I count six broken ribs, one shattered kneecap, and one hut-sized headache. Bring me up to speed. The Republic worms guarding the area were jacked up on some kind of adrenals. They weren't human, they were animals. They shrugged off blaster fire like bug bites, and then tore into my squad. 
I only survived because a grenade knocked me senseless. My plan was to rush in there, take all the adrenals I could find, and complete the mission. But you might have better success. We need that supply depot. In that case, I'll do what must be done. Sure. Won't do the rest of my squad any good. But I'll take a lesson. I'll give you the coordinates to the Republic's adrenal stashes. If they can play that game, so can the Empire. Secure the area for the new supply depot, and make sure Alpha Squad didn't die for nothing. Finding Quesh to your liking. It's in a quiet locale. My lord, may I suggest sampling what luxuries this planet has to offer while you're here? Just tell me where to go. You can find all the latest adrenal formulas available right here in our civilian markets. But... If you're interested in something truly cutting edge, you've heard of the three families? The rebellious huts who've chosen to ally with the Republic. That is my understanding. We intercepted a communication from the three families, indicating that they've moved an experimental formula to Attis Station for final testing. Industry rumors about the formula's effects are nothing short of miraculous. Heightened awareness, near immunity to fatigue or exertion, mild euphoria. It's perfect. I want to acquire some samples for synthesis, to distribute it among our troops, after I've tested its safety, of course. These delusions of grandeur pale before the power of the Force. Of course, my lord, but it would bestow impressive benefits to those of us who lack your natural ability. I don't see us capturing the formula through conventional assault. The army would be most appreciative if you acquired this formula for us. You'll find at his station nearby. It's a Republic research facility disguised as a simple outpost, so it'll be better protected than it appears. The Republic soldiers that killed your squad are no longer a threat. I've called headquarters for reinforcements. Next squad should be here soon to hold the place. But we couldn't have secured it without you. Can't thank you enough. Payback is satisfying. The explosives have been placed, and the Walker convoy destroyed. Excuse me? 
Who is this? What happened to Bravo team? I am a Lord of the Sith, and apprentice to Darth Barris. My Lord, I, I didn't mean any disrespect. I was just surprised to hear from you and not Bravo team. Taking out that convoy saved our skins. We owe you more than thanks for taking on this job, but thank you.
What does Barris think he's doing, sending you here after me? Is he trying to make it look good? Give himself an alibi? Because you can tell him mission accomplished. Almost all of my men are dead. You've done a great job making this look legit. Now back off! You're in league with Barris. Aren't you smart? Yes, of course, idiot. These are my senior officers. We all defected over a decade ago and have been working for Barris since. But wait, you didn't know this? He didn't tell you we were following his command? He tells me everything. Then why? Tell me, after so much loyal service with our covers intact, why is he doing this? This is the eventual fate of every spy, Admiral. I suppose you're right about that. But he can't think that we're going to take this line down. Men, our master has decided we're expendable. Let's prove otherwise. Pity you, his blind, obedient lapdog. No one's safe with Barris. Not even you. Comes with the territory. I hope he dies a painful death. Have the formula samples? Oh, please tell me you have them. It is in my possession. Here, my command's entire recreational spending allocation. Please excuse me, I... I should really see to securing these. <laughs> At your service, my lord. Travel route is confirmed.
The mines are poisoned. The Republic's running scared. Excellent work. You also did a fine job raising their emplacements. My forces will have no trouble cleaning up your scraps. Our next move is to hit the Republic again. Hard. <laughs> Send him in, quickly. Gragg is a leader of the Hutt Cartel. He keeps repulsive company, but he's proven a valuable ally. I can take down the next target without Hutt interference. That may be, but we can't afford to turn away Gragg's support just yet. He's here to make amends for the three families. A band of venom-sniffing Hutts. They violated the cartel's neutrality to help the Republic's mining operation on Quesh. Such favoritism deeply upset the Empire. The cartel claimed ignorance and disowned the three families. With the rogue hut isolated, all that's left is the killing blow. But first, we must sever their source of income, the Republic's adrenal factories. Only then can we destroy the three families. <laughs> Rag, you finally grace us with your presence. Let me introduce the Empire's greatest weapon on Quesh. Gaze upon me, Hut. You won't see someone so powerful again in your lifetime. The three families won't be vulnerable until we sever their income. Are you ready to kill these Jedi and cripple the Republic's adrenal production? Time to hit the Republic where it hurts. Greg, have your army hold the factories. Don't allow the Republic a second's rest. Cut down the Jedi defenders. Then either destroy the adrenal production lines or kill the Selkath scientists operating them. The scientists chose the wrong day to show up for work. If that's your choice... Just don't return until those factories have ground to a halt. Get up. Displaying all authorized destinations.
I just spoke with Gregg. He said you shut down the factories and the fight's under control. Well done. Without adrenals or their Quesh Venom supply, 
The Republic is finally vulnerable. We must hit the three families with everything we have. Slay the Hut slime. Their secrets die with them. The Republic can't process Quesh Venom. And they'll be pushed to the brink of galactic war. All we must do is kill the leaders of the three families. The Huts will fall under my lightsaber. I'm glad you're so eager, my lord. We'll prepare for your attack at once. Colonel, wake Portho the Hut from whatever adrenal-addled haze he's drowning in. Your pathetic hut defenses can't stop a Sith. I'd rather not be comatose in the middle of a firefight. We'll take your recommendation under advisement, Portho. Use your adrenals. When you awake, you'll be the only surviving member of the three families. You heard the fool. Either fight through the front or take Portho's adrenals and be smuggled in. Your choice. The hut can keep his concoction. I'd rather fight on my feet. Portho gave us schematics on the palace's security. You'll need these EMP charges to scramble the generators shielding the main door. Excellent. Once you're inside, kill the leaders of the three families, Portho too. Then upload their data on Quesh Venom processing to me. Good.
Kasu yai koira to kanti kong yasa ukubas kaja bakatun bongo. Calm down. The three families must remain united. You're vital to the Republic's mission. Your hut allies will soon be the Empire's victims, Jedi. Putula musta wo bradik nampio do pushi wompa. Silence, Chilta. If you value your power, bring me the intruders. I'll find you. Even if I have to wade through all the hut guts on Quesh. Turamo, Uban Joraliba is Timbopo. Gadwachi ni Oiga, Anulio Oka Kisa Spita Perupa. Sayadubi no Avadikuna. Chido ni Dindoki. I look forward to meeting this Jedi and cutting him in half. Kutsi Namchi, Jatoni ma Techu. Do mi cha kulka, do maji, ta usa zalas uval. Chuba noe ke nana, shap kisa branga una nupa ye. You're wasting your time, just die. <laughs>
Moff Drayson. I'm patched into the hut's mainframe. This is it. Everything the three families knew about processing Quesh Venom. We can erase the Republic's head start in minutes. As it should be. The Empire owes you much. Thanks to you, the Republic is quickly losing control of Quesh. I see you've killed Jilta and Portho. Outstanding. I wish there was time to celebrate, but our fight's not over yet. We have a hut on the loose. Broga, the last leader of the three families. He escaped before your assault. As if losing that hut slime wasn't enough, we have a new problem. A powerful Jedi Master named Beren Fral just landed on Quesh. Fral was talking to the huts when I arrived. He didn't appreciate the interruption. You must have scared him. Master Fral is wasting no time. He's already amassing forces with Broga the Hut. Slay them both, and the Republic's stranglehold on Quesh will crumble. They will bow to my power, then they will die. Thank you, my lord. Show the Republic how weak they are. Find Master Fral and Broga in the Quesh Venom plant. Tear the facility apart. Make sure they don't leave the place alive. Problems, Sergeant. Oh, uh, uh, yes, my lord. I have encountered a surprising amount of resistance in my assigned task. 
I'm charged with organizing raids against the Republic's mining efforts. We strike targets of opportunity to slow their progress and drive them to retaliate. They've recently constructed a large crane that I thought would make a perfect target. I sent a team, but security was triple the expected strength. My soldiers were slaughtered. Why would security be so heavy? Clearly, the crane is a very important part of the Republic's operations. Far more than we'd first suspected. The crane needs to be destroyed and the Republic punished. But I just don't have the manpower to go up against so much security. Leave that to me. That's very generous of you. Thank you. You'll find the crane at these coordinates. Good hunting.
Joralipa is Timbo. Quiet, Broga. We're not alone. Your strength is impressive, Sith, but no amount of power will take Quesh from the Republic. My lightsaber will cure your confidence. Just try to defeat me. Dinga Dwara Kema Chuba, Mia Brancha Muri Ra. True Jedi need only the Force. Watch your step, Jedi. Tola Ula, Lucha, Nichawa Joto, do the Pita. Ninga Ninga Kituita, Nimo Tanuv Ayola, Tanque Kuta. Nice try, Broga, but you're not weaseling out of this. <laughs> Ah! <laughs> 
The crane has been destroyed, Sergeant. So I've heard. I've been listening in on the Republic's comm channels. They're furious at the loss. You must have done some serious damage. As it should be. It seems the crane was intended to build a powerful shield generator that would have made attacks on the Republic's operation impossible. I shall begin scouting for further targets. Thank you for your help. Without you, our entire mission here might have been dragged to a halt. The Jedi and his hut are dead. Excellent. The Republic will be furious. You have my thanks, and that of my council. We'd still be fighting over Quesh's minds if not for your help. All in a day's work? Your dedication won't be ignored. And if you're still invested in our war, there's more work to be done. The Republic's still fighting. Help us pile up enough bodies here, they'll retaliate on other planets, then we'll have our war. But first, enjoy your victory. Quesh will soon be ours, and the Republic grows more furious by the day. Apprentice, my master Darth Vengeon is distraught. With his covert attack exposed, the Treaty of Coruscant has been broken. And apparently, Moff Maskin did not survive Admiral Monk's ambush. What happened? Admiral Monk must have killed him. Is that so? How interesting. Well, at least you avenged him. What's important is that you accomplished your objective. The elimination of Admiral Monk, it is a major blow to the Republic. 
Now, the final Plan Zero target has been discovered. The hunt for Jedi Knight Zerinder takes you to Hoth. Contact me when you arrive.